Hi, I'm Joseph Morais from Confluent, and I'll be talking to you today about how data streaming can help accelerate your database modernization initiative. We'll walk through an example of how to migrate your data in real time from a legacy database to a modern cloud native database using Apache Kafka and Confluent. There is unprecedented growth in the volumes of data being generated, and it is essential for businesses to be able to contextualize and harness the value of their data in real time. On-premise databases like Oracle, SQL Server, MySQL, etc., are slow and rigid, which is expensive in terms of both upfront and ongoing maintenance costs, and as a result, limit the speed at which businesses can scale, experiment, and drive innovation. Today's organizations need scalable cloud-native databases for improved agility, elasticity, and cost efficiency. With modern databases, companies can focus on building new, real-time applications with ease instead of spending time and resources patching, maintaining, and managing their database. However, migrating and modernizing your database can be a long journey that spans multiple teams and batch-based tools. First, it's highly complex and resource-intensive to load and replicate data from the legacy database and other relevant data sources across on-prem and cloud environments to the modern cloud database. For migrations across different database types, you'll encounter the additional challenge of needing to transform data in order to achieve data and schema compatibility with the target database. Second, it's common to experience latency and stale data during the cloud migration due to batch-based data replication being unsuitable for time-sensitive, mission-critical use cases. Third, the current integration solutions for capturing events from legacy systems are prohibitively expensive, leaving you with either data silos or a costly perpetual license that further locks you in to the legacy vendor's platform. Modernizing your database doesn't have to be this much of a headache. Real-time data streaming powered by Kafka makes it possible to move data reliably at scale while keeping data systems online during the migration through streaming ETL pipelines instead of batch-based processes. Confluent further simplifies and accelerates database modernization efforts with features like cluster linking to easily migrate data across different environments, meaning you everywhere your systems live. Our rich ecosystem of 120 plus pre-built source and sync connectors, including several battle-tested change data capture source connectors, makes it easy to connect multiple data systems and keep them in sync throughout the migration. To transform and process data in flight, leverage single message transforms, or SMTs for short, on connectors for lightweight transformations like masking or filtering, and KSQL DB for more complex stream processing like merging multiple data sources and enriching data. Finally, you can reduce your total cost of ownership using our fully managed cloud native services with no operational overhead or prohibitive licensing costs. Let's get on with an example where we'll show you how to bring this use case to life. Today, let's look at a pretend FinTech company. We'll call them Acela Loans. Let's look at how they go about their database modernization journey by migrating data from Oracle Database and RabbitMQ to MongoDB Atlas in the cloud. Let's say Acela Loans recently acquired a small bank that uses Oracle DB to store sensitive customer information and RabbitMQ as the message broker for credit card transaction events. Acela Loans wants to perform real-time credit card fraud detection analysis to protect their newly acquired customers and push the suspicious activity flags to MongoDB Atlas, their modern cloud native database that powers their mobile apps and app notifications. However, they face a couple of challenges. First, the customer and transactions data they need live in two separate systems, Oracle and RabbitMQ, and they'll need to access and merge the data in order to get a unified view of their customer's credit card activities. Second, they'll need stream processing in order to build a real-time application for fraud detection. Using Confluent, we can build and scale real-time hybrid and multi-cloud data pipelines that move data from any source environment to the cloud database of your choice. Let's go through an overview of our implementation steps. First, we'll extract customer data from Oracle DB to Confluent Cloud using the fully managed Oracle CDC source premium connector. In this demo, we're using an Oracle database that is accessible from the outside. However, you could connect to any Oracle database, either on-premise or in the cloud. Next, we'll mask sensitive customer PII fields as the data streams into the Kafka topic using SMTs on the fully managed Oracle CDC source premium connector. 
Then we'll extract transactions data from our second data source, RabbitMQ, with the fully managed RabbitMQ source connector to Confluent Cloud. Once all of our data is in Confluent Cloud, we'll merge the two data sources with KSQL DB, generating a unified view of the customer and their credit card activity. To help build out our real-time fraud detection use case, we'll leverage KSQL DB aggregates and windowing to create a customer list with potentially stolen credit cards. Finally, we'll load the results into MongoDB Atlas using the fully managed MongoDB Atlas Sync Connector where the team could do further analysis. We're going to do all of that with some sample customer and credit card transactions. At the end of the session, we'll have run through everything you'll need to be prepared for your database modernization journey. And with that, let's take a look at this step by step. Let's start by taking a look at the customer data we have in Oracle DB. In the customer table, we'll have customer ID, customer first and last name, date of birth, average credit spend, and some other customer information. We are going to be using the customer ID field later to match our customer data to their credit card transactions data. Navigate to the connectors page under the data integration menu and search for Oracle CDC Source Premium Connector. This fully managed connector allows you to reliably and cost effectively implement continuous real-time syncs by offloading data from Oracle DB to Kafka without any operational overhead. That's awesome. To configure the connector, we'll supply all the necessary information needed to access our Oracle DB. Near the bottom of the connector configurations page, you'll find the single message transforms related field, which we'll use to mask sensitive customer data. We'll enter a name for the SMT, DOB underscore mask, then click add transforms to reveal additional fields. Select the transformation type as mask field dollar sign value, then select the field DOB on which the masking will be applied. The DOB field will be masked with the value provided in the replacement field, which we'll replace with xxxx-xx-xx. You can use any string value as a replacement here. Let's launch the connector and check to make sure it's up and running. Now, let's check the contents of this oracle.dbusers.customers topic to validate the records coming from Oracle. Here we can see that our SMT is working as expected with the customer's date of birth redacted and replaced with the string pattern of our choice. With our pre-built and fully managed Oracle CDC Premium Connector, you've now performed a highly complex integration with just a few clicks that would have otherwise taken on an average of 12 to 24 engineering months to replicate in-house and even more time and resources to manage. Now we'll switch gears and examine our second data source, which is credit card transaction data in RabbitMQ. Let's take a look at the transactions table. It contains fields like user ID, transaction timestamp, transaction ID, charged amount, and other relevant information. We'll need to get this data into Confluent Cloud as well, which we'll do using the fully managed RabbitMQ source connector. Let's create another Kafka topic called RabbitMQ underscore transactions for the transactions data. We'll search for and start configuring this connector. Similar to the fully managed Oracle CDC connector we used earlier, this fully managed RabbitMQ source connector also abstracts away all of the operational and management burdens associated with self-managing connectors. Let's tell the connector all about our RabbitMQ queue and connection details. Now that our connector is up and running, let's quickly step into the transactions topic and check out the events that are in there. Since the connector is running, it will automatically bring the updated data from Oracle database to Confluent Cloud after the initial setup. For example, if one of our customers recently increased their spending, we want to update average credit spent to make sure we aren't flying transactions based on previous data. Let's go ahead and update Rika Blaisdell's average credit spend by 5,000. Now let's verify the new amount is added to Oracle DB users customers topic. Voila, there you have it. Once all of our data is in Confluent Cloud, it's time to merge them and build our fraud detection logic using KSQL DB, which enables real-time stream processing with SQL-like commands. Let's start by creating a new KSQL DB application and writing some queries. First, we'll create a stream of customer data from the Oracle topic, and a stream of transactions data from the RabbitMQ topic. Then we'll create a table using the customer data stream and the common field customer ID to join with the transactions data stream. Next, we'll begin to write the logic for detecting fraudulent transactions. 
We'll do this by aggregating the streams of transactions for each customer ID using a two hour tumbling window and filter for customers who spend in a two hour period is higher than their average spend. Let's create a new table called possible stolen card, sum their spend over the defined window and compare that to their average spend. Now that we have our customer list with possible fraudulent transactions, let's load this into MongoDB for documentation and further analysis. We'll search for the MongoDB Atlas Sync Connector in Confluent Cloud, and similar to the source connectors, it's a quick and simple process to launch a fully managed sync connector to send data to your target system. Let's tell the connector all about our Mongo database, filling out the connection details, key, schema, and launch the connector. With the connector fully provisioned, let's go over to MongoDB and see what has happened. We could see that all the data is here. We won't go through all the details, but it's sufficient to say that we've taken our data from our legacy database, joined it with other valuable data, and processed it with KSQL DB for real-time fraud detection, and logged the results in a modern cloud database, MongoDB Atlas. Okay, now you have a roadmap for how to modernize your database by bridging your legacy database in any environment to a modern cloud database with Confluent. Good news is that you don't have to use the same data sources and syncs we used in this demo because we have 120 plus pre-built source and sync connectors to meet you wherever your data and applications reside and help you get to production quickly and reliably. You can also check out additional stream processing use cases like the one we did for real-time fraud detection on the new stream processing use cases recipes page. You'll find step-by-step -step walkthroughs of examples from broad stream processing categories like anomaly and pattern detection, customer 360, predictive analytics, and more, along with SQL code you launch in Confluent Cloud with the click of a button. Thanks for watching this demo. We hope you found it helpful in thinking through how you can leverage real-time data streaming with Confluent to help accelerate your database modernization journey. If you'd like to learn more about how to build with Confluent and Kafka, be sure to check out our Confluent developer site where you can access tons of free courses on Kafka, Connect, KSQL DB, and more. And when you're ready to get started for free with Confluent Cloud, no credit card needed. Happy streaming.